Welcome to Tech Tips. I'm Len Groom. Today, we're looking inside the Amsoil Mechanical Lab. Chris Orr, the lab manager, is going to show us around. We opened the Amsoil Mechanical Lab, otherwise known as the AML or Dyno, back in April of 2013. It consists of three dyno cells, 24 by 20 each, uh, with water systems, air systems, and fuel systems to support whatever type of testing that we want to do in the dyno cells. We test uh, everything from passenger car engines to power sports equipment to lawn and garden equipment here. The main purpose of the AML is to validate technologies uh, for product development and for comparative analysis in the market of AMSOIL products and make sure that AMSOIL is producing the best products possible. In cell one, we have a Superflow 902S water break, a Land and Sea 7 inch dyno uh, set up to a custom chainsaw installation and we have three air compressors. In cell two, we have a Midwest 1014 eddy current dyno. It controls from two to 6,000 RPM up to 175 horsepower. We use that for passenger car motor oil development. We also have small engine testing. Cell three, we have a Superflow Cycle Dyne eddy current dyno, and we're gearing up at this point to expand that dyno uh, to a double roll installation. Engines are uh, very sensitive to the combustion air that they get in terms of repeatable power production. Uh, so we have a Munters combustion air unit uh, that provides 3,000 CFM of humidity and temperature controlled air directly to the engines. We do a lot of steady state dyno testing versus performance facilities that might do a very short term test. Uh, so therefore we need a lot of cooling capacity, we need a lot of water capacity. So we do have a 4,000 gallon water system that supplies uh, cooling water and break water to our test cells, as well as a 60 ton evaporative chiller that is roof mounted. So that regardless of the amount of horsepower, or whatever degree of steady state testing we're doing, we can maintain the temperature of our supply of water at all times. All of our fuel, air, and water systems are PLC controlled. It's basically a computer interface. Uh, it can monitor certain conditions, whether it be a temperature, whether it be a pressure, and it can respond automatically in the absence of human intervention. In our test design, if it's desired, we can ramp up the severity of our test and heat load and length of time uh, that that test is conducted for to separate high quality oils. One oil might sputter, cough, and choke and just fall its way across 100 hours where another oil might breeze past 100 hours without breaking a sweat. Most high quality oils are going to do okay in normal operating conditions. So if you want to differentiate that and you want to see what oil is going to be better in severe conditions, you have to design things like that yourself. How do you determine what's great? And that's what we want to do here. In addition to the test facilities, we have a very large work area. Um, everything off test moves to the shop area, is disassembled, is laid out uh, prior to photography for inspection. Building our own facility allows AMSOIL to make decisions quickly and design testing to help differentiate high quality oils, which is something that really isn't available outside of developing your own testing. Well, as you can see, the Mechanical Lab is a very unique facility. This is the facility that allows us to do the testing that gets our products to that next level. Other companies just can't do this. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.